Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. We are into it. It is round one today here in the European 4v4 Gears of War Pro Series. We are going to have Vivify up against Equinox Esports here in the first round matchup. For those who don't know me, I'm Lockdog, your caster, and we will see how these teams are going to play it out here on the first map. We will be starting off here on War Machine and seeing what these teams are going to be able to do as we see Sways up on the catwalk looking for a angle, but he did get, uh, get chunked out early, so he will not be able to go in. Does try and uh, contest across. Does get Vivify Brutal down. Teammate should be able to go in there and clean up that kill. Doesn't quite get it. Teammate should be able to cover him here from Vivify. Can they uh, Can they keep him from getting up? No, Rage is going to get him down as it looks like Swayze is going to be able to pick that Player up, make sure he stays alive, and now it's going to be EQ that have the numbers advantages. They're able to push one back. That's Precise going to go down. They do have another angle on another player there as Precise is going to drop. And now we're going to see Breaker has to get this kill. We'll get taken down by Breaker. And there we go. Demonic is also going to drop. So we have our first round, and it's going to be Equinox picking up the first round of this game or of this map of this competition so far as uh, we are into our first one we'll see what brutal can do yet again he's going to be the one going up the top here to contest against the equinox player that jumps up on the top here have a look have a look around trying to pick up that player with the snub lots of shots go out we'll get tagged up by the Nasher, but doesn't take too much damage, so shouldn't worry him a great deal as he's just trying to get these angles. You can see his teammates just uh, scattered around the map here. Break it is tr trying to get control up the top. That nade went down. Don't believe it went past the other team's side. Just hit the wall next to the torque boat. So that'll drop. That nade comes across. Breaker isn't going to get hit with that one. Has got the snub out. We'll get that down there on combo to take him down. Precise. Also picking up a kill. Now he's got the angle on the entire team. Should be able to just put bullets down. But the headshot comes out. Blade's going to take down Brutal. But Blade's going to go down. And now that's going to be Demonic. Is going to be able to move in. Take down that kill. And it will be Vivify to get the second round here in this one. So we will jump on board with Demonic this round. See what he's going to be able to do. He's the one just sitting over this sniper side, trying to push up as the smoke will come across. Or no, it doesn't actually. Sorry, I thought there was a smoke thrown towards him. There is one behind him at the moment, but that's not going to block his vision at all. As he wants to move up onto this sniper, knows that there's a player there, does have the uh, the map advantage in terms of moving up, pushing that player back up the top. So if he knows that that sniper is safe at least, he should be able to just sit here and survive for now. Not playing too aggressive. Blade, that player that is trying to contest him here. Precise, just trying to push and move across towards that torque bow. Possibly could have picked it up with the smoke there and weapon slide away, but decided against that one. He's going to move straight across onto these sandbags. Now he has the cross. Should be able to get a lot of bullets down. Is not going to be able to pick up that torque bow, and he's just going to move back on towards the sandbags and back towards boxes here as Blade is going to take down Brutal there. As oh, Jay Rake very close to going down. Combo is going to take down Breaker as well. Brutal still sitting down there on the catwalk. Breaker is going to go down there up on that top side. We'll find where Combo is. I believe he's up top and he should be able to get some nice crosses there. We'll be able to take down Precise. And this round should go over to the team of Equinox. There's a lot of shots go out. Demonic's down and there we go. The final kill about to be shown. And we see. It's going to be Equinox that pick up the second round. Uh, the third round, sorry. So make it 2-1, their second round of the game, in fact. 5-1 for Jay Rake, the player that's not actually in this EQ lineup. He's just a fill for today. And he is just turning up here at the moment, as we will see what Demonic can do. He's over this right side yet again. Blade equally uh, pretty standard role over on this uh 
on the sniper side. Precise yet again. Standard roll in the middle here looking for these shots. Would like to see one of these teams try and try something different, make something happen. Maybe catch the team off guard. Does seem Blades going to be able to move down onto the tracks, but not get a lot done here as Precise putting a lot of shots out. Nades do come in. Combo now moving up here on this top side. Will just sit back after getting hit with the shot of the Nasher. Doesn't take him down too low, but doesn't want to go into a fight without full health, so he's going to have to back off and just wait. Is that player is actually going to back off. The sniper was picked up, but Precise is going to take one down. Swayze is going to try and push in. Shots go out. We'll be able to get Brutal down with a lot of shots. Now moves through the smoke, moving up this side. Can he get away? No, he's going to go down. Swayze is uh, going to drop there from Demonic. Demonic's going to be able to pick that one up. The sniper is in the hands there of Blade. And in a 2v3 situation, if he can get a couple of headshots, it's going to turn this round around, in fact. As we'll see what Precise can do. He looks to uh, join his teammate up the top. It's going to be Combo. They're very split up here. One at the sniper, one right up the top. And Combo's going to go down. There's nothing the Blade's going to be able to do about that. He has moved up now, but he doesn't connect with that shot. He's in a 1v3. Knows that there's a player behind him. Can he turn around and get this headshot? Needs to find it. Does get the body shot, but Demonic's just going to back off. Lancer him down and get the kill. So 2-2 is now the score between these two sides. And we've seen these two teams very close to each other in recent pro series. They've always been in this pro bracket. And they are definitely showing up here at the start of this game. So Sway's looking for those shots across mid, not going to connect with any. As Breaker's actually grabbed an edge, he's decided to stay low. But I'm not sure whether he's going to be able to take control of his top side. Has to jump away there. No, the nade just dropped short. So just got clipped on that sandbag. Now he's able to push up, throw out one. That's not going to connect there. It's Try and put out some snub shots, but is pretty low. Brutal does take down Jay Rake. The nade is going to go out. Want to watch where that one goes towards. Didn't see it, but Breaker is in a gun battle. Will get taken down there by Combo. Now Brutal, he has to try and make something happen here on this side. Doesn't get the kill there. Will do now as he backs off that smoke. Going to give him a little bit of cover from behind. So a 3v3 here at the moment. As Blade pushes up, take down Ramonic. Brutal has... Been taken down. Combo had that nice angle there from the Troika pit. Blade's going to be able to pick up that kill. Combo, can he get away? No, he gets down. Precise is going to be able to chase up that kill and pick it up. Now he's in a 1v2 situation. There's two players down the bottom. I believe he does have the torque bow here. And we'll just throw that one out. Doesn't stick. As he just doesn't want to get hit with that sniper. Trying to just get the sneaky stick on the player that does have that long shot over on the left side. But he's not going to be able to connect with that one. Not sure if he has any shots left. So he wants to just play this one slow. He wants the other team to come to him. And EQ, they don't want to throw away a 2v1 advantage. They want to just try and get these angles right. And Blade with that sniper should be looking to go up the opposite side stairs and, and look for that sniper shot. As he does see him, misses him. The, the nades are picked up. They're for precise. He was able to get out cleanly with those, but there are going to be uh, grenades on the other side as well as they do come in. He's going to try and dodge away from them. We'll do so fairly easily here. With the sandbag, play with the sniper is down the bottom. Has to make sure he doesn't get headshotted by that. Just constant awareness of both players here at the moment. The nade comes in. That's not going to connect here as he's got the, uh, got the torque boat charging. Puts the shot out. Now he's going to try and charge this one player. Has got nades. Going to throw both of them out. Not going to connect with either. Does go very weak there to the player with the snub. So he's going to have to just back off this one. Has gone down the stairs. Shots go out here with the snub. Can he beat the Lancer in the fight? No, he can't. Swayze comes around the corner. And that's going to be EQ going up 3-2 here in this one.
So we'll jump on board with Sway, see what he's going to be able to do. And gets a nice shot on the player that was jumping up on there. It is uh, sorry, it is going to be uh, brutal. That's usually up on that top side. Forgot you were started with a B. Didn't couldn't remember the uh, rest of the name there, but brutal usually jumps up on that catwalk there and just got taken down. So we'll see what Demonic's going to be able to do. Throws out the smoke, and uh, that sniper isn't there anymore. It's actually been taken by the team of EQ. So Blade, can he pick up a kill with the angle? that he's got here on this one. Looks to be pushing up this top side. Wants to get the height advantage and try and get some shots off from the top side of the map. And it's uh, definitely going to help him out. If he can get in that Troika pit and stay safe, then he should be able to get some work done. But the torque bow has been picked up by the team on the Locust side that will be Vivify who have picked up that one. It's going to be Brutal that has taken that. He knows that there's going to be a player on that side trying to save the teammate, but Blade does go down uncontested there. And Brutal still, I believe, four shots here in the talk bow. 3v3 situation, but that sniper still going to be in the hands of Breaker now, actually picking it up. So, sniper and talk bow in favour of Vivify here. Nades have been picked up both by both teams, I believe. Anyway, both teams have got their nades ready and active. Brutal just waiting for an angle to try and pick up a player, trying to push away. Swayze has been pushed back into his spawn. And that's exactly what he's waiting for. He can't afford to push back in that talk by just clipping the edge of the wall there so he will be able to survive the sniper shot comes out that's not going to connect with him he's in trouble he's been pushed right back into his spawn combo is on his own up top and jay rake not really in a brilliant position either as he can get flanked from the top side as well so EQ just uh, trying to survive out this round and Vivify just trying to pick him off and should be able to hit that shot, misses that one. There's the player mantled over and Brutal not going to be able to uh, connect with that one. Breaker also has the sniper rifle. Demonic going to be the one with the nades here at the moment. So two long shots and some nades ready to try and uh, snuff out this EQ team. Two players now up on this top side. And Sway is just staying down that bottom side. So he has been able to escape his spawn. Torquo has been picked up now. So I believe that's two long shots and a Torquo here for the team of Vivify. They should be able to pick up at least one or two kills. And then they can move in with the numbers advantage. Use their Nashes and get that advantage. Players pushing back. A nice shot there to take down Sway's Brutal. Brilliant shot. And now they've got the 2v three advantage they should be able to push this one as combo is trying to uh, counter push trying to get this angle but knows there's going to be players watching either side of him so he's just got to be careful there as breaker is trying to push up the back has got the nasher out nades come down he's going to throw a nade so they can't push towards him he has got two nades there forcing and allowing his team to push through. Nade does come in, doesn't connect with him as player now pushing him with the Nasher. Does have the snub out. Can he pick up this kill? Nice shot over those sandbags. Should be able to get a lot of damage down. Missing that last shot. Can he get this kill? As he will get one down and his teammates will help him out with the other. Vivify being able to pick up that round and make a 3-3. We're going into the final round here of this map on War Machine. The first map here in the competition in the pro bracket here of the does play 4v4 European Pro Series here for Gears of War. Okay, moving into this uh, final round, we've got a uh, demonic moving over. Well, he's going to have to back up actually. As Blade just just poking him out, precise, looking for that torque bow, wasn't able to do so. He got very, very weak there. Brutal's actually going to take down Sways there, and he's actually going to take down another kill. So should be able to get two kills. Can't see that player down through the smoke. Can he find this kill? 
as he sees him now, will be able to pick up that kill. Can he get away through the smoke? Even if he doesn't, it's still two for one trade, but he will be able to do so anyway. So it looks like Vivify, they have the advantage here on this map. They've got a 2v4 situation. It's going to be Blade and Combo, the two up and alive. Combo looking for those shots as he's not going to be able to find the down there on that top side. Two players pushing on this bottom side, and Blade is going to go down, so it is going to be combo in a 1v4 situation to keep his team in this map. Has to make something happen. Pushing in now on this top side. Can he get the shots out? No, he slides in, and Breaker's just going to hold his nerve. Take the shot as he was closest, and Vivify going to be able to take that first map. 4-3.